Okay, fam, so it's official. Bird versus New Jersey twerk. Listen, man, I got to get into you in the raw. I told you I'm going to coach you all the way up to this battle. Let me tell you why I'm coaching you all the way up to this battle. You got, you got a reputation now dropping the ball, fam, and I'm sorry. I got to tell you the truth. I'm not going to sugarcoat nothing. You a man. I'm going to talk to you like a man, and I'm going to give it to you in respect, brother. Because at the end of the day, regardless to what, I'm going to tell you this, Bert. This real talk, man. We both from the Midwest. We both from Illinois, fam. Listen, I got a lot of respect for you, fam. I respect what you did for the culture. Man, and you still got battles and rounds that nobody have yet to beat. Have yet to beat. That's a whole nother story. So I definitely got respect for you. I also got a wage on you. That says enough in itself. Seeing that you didn't drop the ball a lot of times. But I know it's something in that tank. I know it's something in that tank. And I know you're not done yet. And you've been given a shot. You've been given a shot to really stick it to the URL. That's a shot that they gave you. They accidentally gave you this shot, though. But this your chance to really stick it to them. They gave you they rising superstar. And let me keep it real. The boy is bad. The man is definitely a superstar. The boy, if he, if he take his career serious and do what he have to do, oh, he definitely here. He definitely here to stay. And go whoop a lot of people butt. And you've been given that shot, fam. One of the top dudes in the game on fire. You don't have no excuse. You don't have no excuse at all. And you've been known for dropping the ball, fam. You was asking for Charlie Cliff for years. And once you were finally given Charlie Cliff, you dropped the ball, fam. Horribly. It didn't even come close. He was garbage too. But that's the worst you ever performed and put on. And that's unacceptable, fam. He was given another shot at Summer Madness. Summer Madness. With Puffy, Buster Rhymes, Q-Tip them in the building. Better come see you. They would better come see you, fam. I'm going to prove to you that they were there to come and see you. I don't care. Oh, they knew Moot. Moot was cool with them. Who Puff put the money on? Who Puff put the money on? He put the money on you and Rex. Why would he, why would he do that? He put the money on you and Rex because he knew that y'all two was running the game. Rex was the best in the East and you were the best that the Midwest had. You were leading the Midwest movement, fam. He knew who to put the money on. He knew Lux was performing. Why he didn't put it on Lux? He knew Mook was performing. Why he didn't put it on Moot? Y'all wasn't even the main event. Why he didn't put it on them? Because he knew what was the real battle. Why y'all think y'all went on in the middle like that? When the crowd is fresh. They knew that. They knew that, fam. He put that money on you. On y'all. That battle. You dropped the ball. You dropped the ball. It don't matter you distract. You dropped the ball. Because let me tell you. That stuff you were saying... Even if the crowd would have let you rap, that wasn't good enough compared to what Rex had. What you said was okay, but it wasn't good enough. And you lost $10,000 extra. And you had a chance to perform in front of one of the biggest CEOs in hip hop. And, you, and, and, and here, you, here you is trying to get a record deal. Even though you said you had a record deal. But come on, this Puffy. It puffy. Come on, man. That was horrible. You lost. Horribly. Then you lost the gems. Another money battle. That's unacceptable. That is unacceptable. No top tier should ever lose to gems. Period. No disrespect to gems. I believe he didn't got better, but it listen. No top tier carrying that banner lose to gems. Period. Especially for no money. Period. That's unacceptable. 
then Bonnie Godiva. All the time we wanted to see you with a woman. Going up against a woman. I was disappointed in that battle. You won, but it wasn't good enough. You barely won. She made that close. And crazy thing about it, some people actually got her women. That's unacceptable. So you have dropped the ball on numerous occasions, fam. That's unacceptable. I need you, fam, to come with it. You talk a lot of game. When it comes to you talking and doing these interviews, man, that sounds good. You definitely can sell the fight. But your performance got to be just as good as your talking, brother. And this is what I'm telling you. It's no excuses. When you get in this ring with New Jersey twerk, let me tell you something. You ain't got no excuses. You always complain about how New York don't let you around. And how people bias. Well, you in a small room. None of that, all that threw out the window. You ain't going to have no excuse. You get to do whatever you want to do. And this is what I want to address when it comes to you, Bird. Don't do whatever you want to do. Do what you know you have to do. And let me tell you something what I mean by that. This young boy going to try to bar you away. And the, look, and how creative he is with them bars, man. That dude don't play no games, man. You can say what you want about him. You can underplay him as much as you want. You can say he a rookie. Like you be talking all these young dudes. They don't know nothing. Uh, uh, they ain't been here. You know what I'm saying? We, we made the way for them. All that talking sound good. Nobody gives a damn. Nobody cares. Nobody cares what you did yesterday. What matters is what's going on today. When you get in that ring with him, fam, I don't even want to hear you say showtime. How about that? Don't even say showtime. Just be showtime. Out the gate. Don't do no long, drawn stories like, you know what, let me tell you something. Don't do that. Don't do that. We need the SB verb. We need the Cortez verb. We need that. Now, I see you losing weight. So you're getting your breathing back in order because you know you were slipping on that, fam. I'm just speaking some real stuff to you, fam. Because I care. Regardless of how you think, how you feel, fam, I care. I got love and respect for every last one of you brothers, man. For every last one of you brothers. Yeah, brothers get on each other's nerves. That happens. But at the end of the day, we still brothers, fam. And I'm telling you what's real. You got to come through on this, fam. You ain't, you ain't had a one-on-one -on -one battle on the URL in a long time. You got to come through for this, man. You got to make your presence felt. You got to hit this dude upside his head. You hit him upside his head, fam, you back in the game on top. When everybody counting you out to be washed up. You don't have no excuses, fam. I believe you can do it. I know you got it in you to do it. But will you honestly do it? Are you really going to take this battle serious? Because you got a tendency, fam, where you slack up, man. You let up. I think twerk is more than enough motivation to push your pen. He more than enough. He like, he like, like the top five dude in the game right now. You've been given the shot. Now take it and make it work. I believe in you, bro. I believe in you. I just want you, man, to get your head in the game, fam. And let me tell you something, man. And I know this real talk. I don't care how you think, how you feel, what you say. Listen, I know Hitman Holly, your brother. I know you love him and got respect for that young brother. But you still got a bitter taste in your mouth seeing how, man, this brother is successful when you literally bought him in the game. And he surpassed you. You know why? Because he stayed hungry. He stayed hungry. You lost your hunger. He kept his hunger. When you supposed to be right there even higher. 
It ain't too late, fam. Execute. Execute. It's time for it. So all that jacking, all that Twitter talk, all that Facebook stuff, fam, all them interviews that sound real good, but you've been given a shot. You know how you talk about how the, how the URL don't really mess with you, don't really F with you? Okay. They gave you a shot at they killer. And that shot wasn't for you to win. You do know that, don't you? That shot is not for you to win. That shot is to build twerk brand up. Because he, look, they building him to be a top killer. But he got to have killers on that resume that he killed. He dropped the ball against Cortez. Remember how you used to make fun of Cortez all the time? Talking about how they couldn't sit at the cool table, him and Shine. Remember that? Him, Shine, DNA. Remember that? Well, Cortez did the job. Is you going to let Cortez outdo you? Are you going to let Cortez outdo you? Can you do the job? And this brother said he coming for you and he taking you serious. And you know what? I know he taking you serious. Because right now, you his biggest match of his career yet. In a small room, everything going to be heard, bird. Your stumbling going to be heard if you stumble. Your fumbling and choking and them excuses you be doing when you mess up. When you a rap and a mess up, and then you'll be like, huh? Well, what? Man, you know ain't nobody said nothing to you. You messed up. That's going to be heard. It's going to be so clear. So you got the man. Put in that work and preparate, fam. I'm going to coach you all the way through the, to this battle, fam. Humble yourself. Take my word. You teach a wise man he love you. Fools hate corrections. I know you ain't no fool. You're a smart man. Some of your judgment is questionable. Definitely that. You did summer videos in the winter. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> you can't do rap videos in the winter unless they Christmas songs. You know how crazy that's going to be watching those videos in the summer and spring and you ain't covered in snow. Everybody know that's a no-no to doing videos. Listen, before you do... Before you make any more moves, fam, holler at me, fam. Holler at me. You know how you always be want to upgrade people, fam? You need to be upgraded. A lot of that stuff questionable, fam. I would have been got you that deal. <laughs> I would have been got you the puffy cash money deal. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on. Listen, that's another. I got you, though. Don't worry about it. I got you. I'm going to give you this wisdom, young man. I'm going to give you this wisdom. I ain't going to charge you a thing. I need you to get the... I need you to win for this 250. <laughs> I'm keeping it real, brother. If I got to be nice to you to get this 250, <laughs> you all right with me. With that being said, this battle truth. It ain't my judgment that's in question. It's yours. Let's get it, fam. <laughs>